So I'm never going to understand why they mail your product in the box that they ship it in a container and then in the back of a tractor trailer and then the mail go ahead and delivers it in its box that it came in. Nice hole in the box there. I mean, seriously, I just don't understand when it became okay not to put stuff in another box. Especially something that's electronic, like a sewing machine or a monitor. I mean, I got my three monitors just in the boxes that they were shipped in as well. Anywho, that's enough complaining. Just got this nice... 6700 and yeah, 6700C. So, there's my old one. It still works fine, but this is supposedly more industrial. Not industrial, but just more. I mean, I got it from Amazon for 2.99 which is cheaper than everybody else by 40 bucks, including Singer's website. And I called and spoke to Singer, and the girl at Singer said that the 6800 was good, but then I saw a 6600, 6700, 6800, and I'm like, well, oh, one's just got to be a newer model than the other, more or less, even though they also have a 25-year warranty on them. But this is it. This is packed. Make sure there's no problems. Good old styrofoam. Someday I'll get rid of that garbage. I mean, there's holes in like all kinds. Of, like, there's a hole in there. Right through to the other side. That's why I buy stuff from Amazon. I have no problem sending stuff back to those people. Those people. This is the, I think, the hundred dollars in extra accessories that it came with, or something similar. Let's see. Uh, what I want to see is my presser foot or my walking foot, which I do not see. I'll come back to that in a minute. Oh, there it is, right there. And that's what you want, baby. Yeah, I'm gonna pause this and pull it out. All right, just grabbed it by the handle, pulled it out. Relatively simple, believe it or not. One of the simplest things to get out. All right, now I'll split this here. All right, well, that's that. Check that in a second. Okay, and not for nothing, the. The sewing machine, this clip went together like this, it slides right in. So it's pretty stiff in there, so I'll give him credit for that. So it didn't bounce around or jar around, it went right between that. Alright, we got all kinds of stuff set up. Electronics, spools are already on there, so it's been wound. Piece of paper, not even fabric. Alright. So this is the heavy duty here. Supposedly with a bunch of stitches. Switch them down here. Can't get enough of surface. There we go. And bada bing. Alright, so we'll crank it up. Check it out. Got roller measurements on the front. Reverse stitch. Oh, it's got a CD player. Play and pause. And hmm. that's probably the cutter. And that raises the needle. It looks like. I guess I'll have to read the instructions, but pretty cool. So this is the 6700, I believe. 6700C. The 6600 was just a smaller panel, and it was digital. And like, you know, uh, an old digital watch, it read. So it still did everything, but for like literally $80 more, it's going to last me the rest of my life. So a little bit of, a little more. So hopefully this thing will sew through some leather. I'm in the process of doing a couple of things right now. Just finished up. Just got to sew this together. 
two belts. Just reused them. So, alright, I got too much stuff to play with. Later.